Hello ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining. My name is Alexander Dijkshorn and I'm a PhD student uh, at the Robotics and Mechatronics Group at the University of Twente. In this presentation, I want to give you a short overview of our work on DC electric uh, metamaterial behavior in tuned fuse deposition modeling prints. The 3D printing method of fuse deposition modeling holds the potential for fabrication of sensors. Due to the line and layer-wise manufacturing, it introduces anisotropic conductivity. In this research, we study the use of anisotropy for realizing DC electric metamaterial behavior. Metamaterials have been used in sensors to enhance sensitivity and to, for example, cloak the sensor from the environment. Uh, and by making metamaterials, FDM offers advantages in, for example, cost and geometric freedom with respect to current manufacturing methods. We believe that 3D printed metamaterials offer an additional tool for the realization of 3D printed extenders and conductors. A metamaterial is a rationally designed material where the structure dictates the properties. In this research, the electrical properties are dictated by the contact resistance between printed lines instead of by the uh, material resistivity. The top figure shows the voltage distribution in a metamaterial sample with anisotropic conduction, yielding a skewing of the voltage distribution. In this research, we studied the effect of the nozzle temperature, bed temperature and extrusion width on the contact resistance and therefore on the anisotropy in the samples. This showed that the anisotropy enhanced contact resistance decreased with increasing bed and nozzle temperature and increased with extrusion width. This was confirmed by microscopy of the cross sections of the samples showing a difference in the contact quality for these different parameters. The parameters causing high anisotropy were used in the demonstration of a 3D printed concentrator to concentrate the currents through the center area. Voltage probe measurements and infrared thermography measurements showed the concentration of current through the center uh, with a higher voltage gradient. These kind of structures are interested for sensing by, for example, increasing the sensitivity locally in 3D printed sensors. Please come by at our poster presentation for further discussion and questions. We want to thank the European Research Council under Horizon 2020 program for their support. Thank you for listening.